Hello everyone, Joe here from Raps Caps. I got 9% battery, I'm gonna try to make this quick. My last stream didn't work for you, but that's okay, because I'm here live now. I'm gonna enjoy my morning walk, and I saw some awesome mycelium on the ground, and I wanted to make sure I shared it with everyone for a quick, what is mycelium lesson. So to break it down quickly for you, there's a saying, mushrooms are mycelium, mycelium are mushrooms. What does that mean? That means that mushrooms are the fruit body of mycelium, just as the tomato is the fruit body to the tomato plant. Uh, mycelium is a living organism. It's one cell layer thick. It breathes in oxygen. It exhales CO2 just as we do. And it's of the fungi kingdom. The fungi is the third of the kingdoms, along with plants and animals. Uh, where can you find it growing? Everywhere. So I'm in the woods right now. The mycelium grows all throughout the soil and it also grows up the trees. And what it does with the trees is it takes in oxygen from, from its leaves, the trees helping it take in oxygen. It also brings in carbon through that and then it takes it down its networks and stores it below the soil. Uh, mycelium grows in networks. So what it'll do is it'll grow all throughout the soil and it'll connect to each other. And it lives right below the earth here. Mycelium's job is a decomposer. So that's why you'll find uh, mold or fungus growing on, on dead things. Also wood chips, you'll see on the forest floor here, it's dead. Um, so they decompose things, but look at what I found right here. This is what I wanted to show you. So that is mycelium. That is mycelium that's connecting a stick with a piece of bark here. And the reason why that's probably happening is because there's mycelium probably living, and you can see there's mycelium living all throughout this bark. So it's connecting the two right there. And look at look at right below. Here's more mycelium. See this? If I if you start to brush away the floor of the woods, see that? It exposes mycelium. This is not cobwebs, this is not spider webs. Um, uh, this is this is mycelium, and you can tell because it looks like roots of, of a of a um, of a plant, but it's not roots. That's all uh, the the extensions of the mycelium living all throughout the forest floor here. Um, and this is how you'll know when you're walking in the woods with your family, when you're walking in the woods by yourself, and you and you come across what looks like maybe cobwebs on the ground. Um, what I encourage you to do is to brush away the leaves, just as I'm doing here and it will expose all of the mycelium that's living all throughout the bottom of the soil here. Um, so this is all one living organism right here connected through these networks. This right here is breathing in oxygen. It's exhaling CO2 just as we do. Um, and what it'll do, once the time is right, it'll actually produce and fruit a mushroom out. And quickly I'll show you over here a good example. Here's another branch that's on the floor. That's more mycelium right there. You see that right there, that white stuff. And here we have a mushroom, no surprise to us. So, um, so yeah, so, uh, so that is a quick lesson. I'm on 4% battery here, so I'm gonna make sure that my phone doesn't die. I hope that was a quick overview of uh, what mycelium is. Um, and yeah, next time you're out in the woods uh, and you see some cobwebs on the floor, move away the brush a little bit and then uh, you'll see some mycelium. You learned something today. All right, everyone, if you want to learn more about mushrooms, you can go to rapscaps.com and subscribe to our free email list where I send all of this mushroom 101 education, free content, mushroom recipes, really good. Um, and then you can also shop our store on the website. We're supporting honeybee research. For those of you that don't know, the honeybee population right now is dying off. A third of the overall bee population around the world is dying off from colony collapse disorder. Uh, but mushroom mycelium, is being shown right now to actually be a solution to that uh, to help the bees fight off this virus so a, a, a portion of all of our proceeds goes towards that research all right everyone take care i hope you enjoy your day we'll see you soon bye, -bye.